In today's video we'll be taking a look at the old Madison nightclub. It was opened in 1974 by Taz Leisure and it occupied some space above the retail units on Corporation Road. It was accessed by a door just outside the Cleveland Centre which led to a set of stairs which unlike the Lion and Falcon meant that it could be accessed after hours without having to walk through the Cleveland Centre itself. Due to its location essentially inside the Cleveland Centre it was also accessible from the car park on the roof of the Cleveland Centre it was handy because taxis could hang there waiting for a fare and it was also handy if you got tapped up and needed to make a quick exit. The Madison nightclub was the place to go in Middlesbrough for many years hosting various acts, DJs and there's a lot of pictures online of various celebrities visiting. I did manage to see uh, quite a lot of pictures of people from em Emmerdale going there which is quite interesting. Now, it was operated by Taz Leisure right up until the 1980s or the end of the 1980s when it was sold to Granada Leisure and they bought Billy Paul's at the same time. Now they ran it for quite a few years, pretty much in the same guise as, as we know it as now, until they decided to close the doors, sadly, after 26 years in May 2000. Which is a shame really, because I know a lot of people, certainly a lot of people watching this video will have good memories of that place, and I know I certainly do. Now the corner of the Cleveland Centre where the Madison was located is pretty much owned by Barclays Bank now. The full area has had a complete remodel, and it was assumed that the space that the Madison once occupied had then been swallowed into that development by Barclays Bank. Now it wasn't long before a few rumours started floating around about the space still being there. The Barclays hadn't used all of it after all. And a year or so later a local newspaper shared some images online, still images, of what we thought was the space. And that's all we've ever seen really. So the question is, are those rumours true? Is the space still there? Has it been swallowed up by a Barclays Bank? Do they use it for storage? Do, did they decorate it? What happened to it? Well, I joined Craig Weatherall from the Cleveland Centre team to find out. So there's that lift that we've seen down in. Oh, there. Yeah, the bottom of the ground floor lift. Well, the I'm going to have to try and see where I'm walking here. Do you even like it? I like the sound of that. Right, where's my bearing? Right. Oh. The stage was there. Yeah, the back wall. And there was a bar in that corner. At the back? Yeah. What's that doorway for there, Craig? There's one of the uh, one's the cellar, or oh, they're both bottle sellers. So if the bar was here, the stage was here. Yeah. You can see the line. Yeah, I can see the line there, yeah. That was the stage. There's a bar in that corner. There's just the cellars for oh, electrical rooms. Alright, so they don't particularly go anywhere. Yeah. Nah. And then either side, there's two fire escapes there and there. So where do they go out to? Does that one go out onto the loading area? Oh, the car park. Oh, yeah, there's two toilets. This used to be the dressing room for the acts. Yeah. And that's just going out in the car park. Ah, yeah. There's fire exit. There's only access to here from there. And there's another fire exit the other side, did you say? Yeah, same the other side. So, where did that original staircase come up? Sure, yeah. The outside one. There's a big ledge there, there is. So dance floor was was that down? Dance that was here. Yeah. I've been the on it. The DJ booth was around that pillar. Yeah, it was sort of like sat in the middle, wasn't it? The telephone box was there. Yeah. <laughs> right next to DJ booth. Yeah. And there was a there was sort of, I remember there being a bar as you came in. There was a bar there. See that? Yeah, that's it. And then the, the toilets were over here, I think. The toilets are still no, not there, but there's all this one back. Can you manage? Yeah. I probably can't. It was here, yeah. That wall there, the design of that wall was a restaurant. That, and is that where it sort of dropped down slightly? No, the restaurant was on the same level, then in the corner, and then the ladders are, just past the ladders. Yeah. That's where the door was to go downstairs 
uh, Macy's. Macy's. Yeah. Sorry. See, I remember, I remember these where they were. They're just empty shell now. You can see the old tiles there when they've just been tiled over. Them. Again, was this always a club, Craig? They set this face. Yeah, you can see the, the, the old tiles there as well. So this was the ladies, the gents that side. This side, yeah. But obviously this wall's been knocked through. Now, the gents, there was a service corridor there. So the ladies came in, that door and that door. The gents had one door. One door. And you ran over there. Yeah. Ah, yeah, dingy wet floor. Yeah, again, you can see the old tiles there, can't you? Yeah. Madison logo. Madison logo, yeah. Dingy wet floor because everyone's peed on it. Yeah. <laughs> Did you come to this club yourself then, Craig? Yeah. Yeah, I did. So this has just been put in this wall. Yeah. So this is how the wall's back there. Yeah. Upstairs. Upstairs, yeah. Where we were. How come they didn't take all the space then? Didn't need it. They didn't need it. So this was the the office. Yeah. Window here. Yeah. Stairs the other side of the window going up and down. And that's where you came in? Yeah. That's where, so the office where you paid your money? That's where you paid the... Uh, Got you. And so you'd have come round this corner, you walked out of here, um, the bar was at the back, yeah. sort of over there, yeah. that's it. That. Yeah. Yeah, we always just hang about here. DJ Booth was about there. Yeah. We, were always, we always just hang about here. That's got stuff written on the windows. Donny. A window broke there. Yeah, someone put it Yeah, from outside. So that is that the car park? Car park the road. That's set the north east. Ah, okay. And that, that road That's the road on there, yeah. Yeah, car park's like above us, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Did it, oh, it didn't always have that ceiling, did it? No, no, no. It's been stripped. So all the beams Yeah, you see, this is about the size I remember. Mm -hmm. So when we went downstairs to what was Billy Paul's, I thought, I remember it being bigger than this, but I remember this being about this size. Brilliant. So what you can see here is the Madison from the car park. Taxis used to pull up along here on the night and used to be allowed to use this exit here, which obviously is now caged off it's various like air conditioning machines and things like that you just see, see the door there so this is roof here here's the Madison from the car park and if we walk around this side of the unit you'll see an exit which I believe is what you see at the back of the stage inside the building Stage exit rear, I suppose. Which is probably a fire exit as well, if the truth be told. And there we go. I believe those doors are what leads to the back of the stage in the Madison. You 
see this guy This guy's in love with you Yes, I'm in love Who looks at you the way I do When you smile I can I show you I'm glad I got to know you Cause I've heard some talk They say you think I'm fine Yes, I'm in love And what I'd do to make Just die.